Okay, Paul Richards here from PTZ Optics. I'm here with our lead support technician, Andy Chaffield. How are you doing, guys? And today we are going to be showing live streaming on YouTube Live uh, with two PTZ Optics cameras, a 12X STI and a 20X STI, with the Epifan Pearl and a DJI Phantom 3 Pro live drone. So we're going to show aerial test footage alongside with two live streaming cameras. Everything's going to be streamed to YouTube Live. And we are going to be showing um, the Epifan Pearl actually streaming everything with branded content and hopefully a really professional live stream available on YouTube Live. So before we get started, let's go ahead and take a look at the application diagram so you guys can see exactly what we're doing. Uh, what we're doing here is we have the Epifan Pearl at the heart of everything. We've got two SDI cameras plugged into the SDI ports of the Epifan Pearl. Uh, we have an HDMI input coming from the DJI Phantom 3 controller. So if you have the latest firmware on your DJI Phantom 3 and you've got either a pro or an advanced model, you can actually upgrade the remote control to have an HDMI output. So we're taking that HDMI output, we're plugging it into the Pearl, and that's how we're going to mix in that live feed from the drone. So that's pretty much everything there. Andy's also got an RS-232 joystick so that he can control the, um, the camera itself. And then we've also got an audio mixing board here bringing in this wireless lapel microphone that I'm wearing. So before we get started, I just want to talk a little bit about safety tips when you're flying drones. Uh, there's not a whole lot of regulations currently, but there's a lot of things being talked about. And there, the laws may even require a uh, drone pilot license to be used for commercial uses. So the very first thing is don't multitask and respect the drone operator. Um, so that's why Andy's here. He's going to be operating the audiovisual equipment while I'm operating the drone. So you know, always you know, keep that in mind. Keep the drone within line of sight. Um, that's in all the manuals. Uh, you always want to keep the drone in line of sight. Uh, you want to read all the safety guidelines that come from the manufacturer. Every drone is different. They all have different capabilities. And you want to make sure you read through those, those guidelines and make sure you understand your uh, copter. Uh, you want to follow all local, state, and federal laws. Um, like I said, you know, a lot of the laws are still being made about this equipment, but make sure you know, in your area you are following them. One law across the board is you cannot fly anywhere within three miles of an airport. Um, you also want to follow, um, you, one, of, one of the things you want to obviously is fly safely, but also one, a, good, a good idea is to get a waiver signed by everyone in attendance of your live broadcast if you plan on flying your drone during an event where there's lots of uh, people. So you, that, that's a good thing to keep yourself covered. So let's go ahead and switch to the live view. I'm going to go ahead and grab our, um, my, my drone operation here. And I'm going to go ahead and start flying. So we've got a live feed from the drone. And I'm going to go ahead and turn the drone on. And uh, take off. So as you can see here, I'm going to back it up because it's a little loud there. But this gives you an idea of what you could do. I'm sure your brains are spinning now. You're seeing what you could do in a live broadcast scenario with a drone like this. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and take it up a little higher here and kind of zoom down there. I'll give you an idea. Now, just, just imagine uh, the capabilities of this during a live broadcast. Uh, you know, you're doing a live streaming event for a band and uh, or may maybe, maybe some type of, uh, you know, overhead shot that you want to be able to get. You know, we can take this up to 400 feet in the sky uh, easily without losing signal. And uh, you can see here the drone right now is hovering at about 150. And uh, so we lost our signal because I didn't keep it in line of sight. Are you getting signal, Andy? Okay. And then what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take it back down. There we go. Let's take her down. And I'm going to land the drone. There we go. 
So we've brought the drone back down to eye level. And one of the things you always want to do is safely land your drone. So I'm going to go ahead and slowly land the drone here. And that's just an example of what you can do during a live broadcast show. Um, so and if you want to go ahead back to the um, our normal setup there and turn this off. Um, so just a little bit more here. Uh, PTZ Optics is a live broadcast and streaming company. Uh, so we're always working on technology like this. And um, you know we always want to stay ahead of the market. So that's why we're doing videos like this. And uh, hopefully you guys can uh, learn a lot from us. Follow our blog and uh, follow us on Twitter so that you can learn more about you know, staying on uh, live broadcast, um, you know, how, to, how to do these types of events. So thank you for watching and have a nice day.